Now, I believe the Romulans definitely use cloaking technology. Uh, definitely. So, let me provide myself with more information. I believe the low temperature. So, sacrificing speed for the sake of lower emission signature and power consumption. This power for throttle allows ship to uh, descend speed while being able to evade enemy sensors. Ships equipped with these engines should be more expensive and slower. But they will enjoy slightly higher evasion chances due to their smaller energy signature. Quite nice to have. Uh, the others are just uh, more bulky. Let's go for low temperature thrusters. So the next research that we're going to be looking into is... I believe we have this. Yeah. Give me a sign. There we go. So torpedo warhead damage plus 5%. Polarizing all is quite nice. Um, so are these actually... But we'll go for where we have the resources from. Yo. Can't build this yet. Okay, why? Oh, I'm an idiot. Yeah, there we go. See, I told you I've not played in a while. So you have to forgive me for that. Uh, let's build all of these. And we'll save up. Well, actually, I want to buy more alloys. So we can get another colonization ship going. Also, I want another scientist. So let's go over here and we'll uh, sell 250 of that, 150 of those, sell two of 500 since we don't have anything else to do with it anyways. And we'll buy, how expensive is that? Let's do it like this. I believe one more, 220 is, uh, is what we need for another colonization ship but we'll build a science ship and then oh, wow it's expensive yeah it is the uh the supplies as well after the science ship we're going to be building another colonization ship maybe we should go colonizing first so there's the components colony development speed plus 25 hardening fields Geomedical power station and solar. So we want to go economy or we want to go towards having shields. Now we know that our enemy might not have any way of defeating shields, right? So we'll go hardening fields. I want to go defensive first and slowly we do want to... Can I now reassign this? Can, can we now change the ship design? Can't change... Ah, oh, that's so dumb. We'll just give it a space then. <sighs> get rid of that. Now we can actually... Get rid of the space. Now we can't. Uh, but at least we can upgrade these. And not too expensive. But we'll get a tiny, tiny bit more of evasion. Uh, these guys will build up nicely. That's going to be nice. I do want to start making sure that we connect territories with them. Since they are not doing anything by themselves. Which is, uh, you know, a shame. I would like to see, even if the these guys are like vassals, they do stuff. That would have been so good. That would have been really good. Okay, so that planet is building. These guys are exploring. He is going to go into that system. And uh, we got an anomaly here. And uh, we will research that since it is a routine. Large craters. Perhaps we get some uh, some minerals. That would be nice. Let's see. We can almost build that other colonization ship. So I want to build two more colonization ships. That's the goal. That is the goal. Just make sure we go. So as for unity, perhaps... Getting into Starbase influence cost is actually quite nice to have early on. Oh, there is no pop growth in this anymore. Okay, maybe it's not that interesting anymore. Then it's only the influence cost that's really interesting me right now. Yeah, it's, that is actually the only thing. So we'll definitely go Discovery. Let's go Discovery and let's go to faster speed for now. The game did get a very good upgrade. 
uh, in terms of like playability and that was one of my main issues that I really didn't like so let's uh, go to normal speed for this artisan shop produces luxury unity and supplies we don't have any slavery just yet so when we don't have to go for that Leader cost negative 20, educational reforms. You know, uh, let, let's go for the ideological pathway, whatever. And we already make 123 uh, more signs. That's almost, almost double of what we started. So there's a crater. Let's go broom and we get a sick. Oh, that is, wow, that is strong, dude. That, uh, was it engineering, right? Yeah, engineering research plus six. Damn, that's nice. So once he is done, he's going to be going into these sections. And we'll just see about that. We can now go after those upgrades. We'll go colony ship. Go another colony. Let's go speed up. Save up a tiny bit of the economy. And I do want to start making sure that we got more of these ships in it. Just, just build it up there. So we reach like a hundred, so auto best. I don't want that. Actually, I kind of don't like that's in there. Oh, there we go. Now it's gone. We can potentially remove them. The event, the admiration happens in seven days. Uh, we have contacted by untrustable channel by mysterious conclave of Aeth. Organism within the Talshare. They operate outside of jurisdiction with all their single purposes. The destroyer. Oh, that's cool, man. Let's 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 invest that. Uh, it's probably in here somewhere. Situation anomaly? No. Interesting. Not in there at all. Oh well. The um, Edmodition. Oh, we get. Oh, look at that. That is really good. So we got a timed project there. We have traditions. Let's go with discovery. Since we have the research bleed plus twenty. Uh, time project where go to so that's over here what does need to go there a science ship um how far is the construction of one how long does it last a thousand days well no problem there we just um wait until this one has been constructed uh, this colony ship is probably going over here because i do like the additional food more than I like the size of the planet right now. So Nimbus, go there. Inside the borders. Oh yeah, I completely forgot that. It is not in our borders yet. So we'll go for... Well, size does matter, right? I know, I know. Shouldn't say it like that. Uh, and once he is done, he goes to Nimbus. And I would like to make sure that we, we don't have any other uh empires just just boxing us in right promising candidate we got rex i would like that if you clicked it that it would actually open up the leader tab uh where is rex there is rex influence production plus 10 latinum production that is actually quite good i do like that so we're going to be replacing him because I believe we got... Do we have influence production? We got production of three. Uh, I think it's from the main building. No, it isn't. What is producing the influence? It could be from the planet itself. Probably. But we're going to be replacing him. So, we got a promising candidate. Why not use him? Why not? So, he's going over there. We're waiting here. There's the science ship. Let's take a look. Leaders. Oh, we got a spark of genius. That's just gorgeous. Let's go. Technology. And that's a demanical guy. He was there. Sometimes, that is just awkward. So, you go here, research that project. 
Uh, incoming uh, information. We got my name started. I uh, have leading a research team advancing studies in the non Romulan behavior trends. He said, Now we made a substantial breakthrough, offering a number of pretend. Okay, that's cool. Let's wait here. Let's pause the game. It used. It, I did select that it would be pausing on events, but apparently they don't freaking care. Uh, we're going to be going for the slave labor since the other option is completely axed out. And domestics again, and we'll go for low intensity. So we got the slave army and the share the burden slave policies and stuff like that, but we don't have those yet. Don't have them at all. Uh, import ice water, regional capital. Definitely go for the regional capital because that's just a good upgradable building. And we are currently building the other colonization ship. So he's going to be colonizing, and then we go for this one. He should be done by then. He should be done by then. And you can see there's trade there, there's trade here. And we're not using it. So we do want to have a station that is dedicated to trade. And eventually just cross them over our entire border. Gain the level, that's good. We gain the research. We can actually build up Kimu site right now. We can go for different fusion torpedoes. But actually it's the wrong one. Hmm... Upkeep is really... Look at that. It produces uh, those plates. And those plates you will need to upgrade stations. So it, it is important to get the Dirarium Forts. But damn, look at that. Just alloys. Negative 20 it would go for. Shield Head Plunge plus 5. But actually... Yeah. We don't know what's going to happen with this. So we might be facing a very, very strong enemy over there. Uh, hardening fields are done. Automatic exploration is, is definitely one of my all-time favorite things to have. Uh, so we'll just get it right away. Uh, we got our scientist leveling up and our president is leveling up as well. Monthly minerals and science ship building cost anomaly research. One thing that we could actually do is look at what kind of leader do we have and try to see if we were this person. What would we do? It is possible, right? So, building those science ships is actually something that I think he or she would do. Uh, in this case, oh yeah, it's a she. So, once we got those other science on this, the science will be absolutely drastic. I like, I'm going to love the science in this game. We're going to be very high on that. We got a new scientist that has been um, demonstrating. Dear Lord, um... Incoming, what's this? I'm the Gestel. We know that you are a Roman and devil. Destroyed our world, butchered our people, and for what? Just because to defend ourselves from expansion into our territory. Leave us or die. Prepare to join the rest of your people. We don't have to care about them, right? So that's over there, Alien Station. I think that is this one. Scientist 9. Now we are going to be building another science ship. I want to have one more. So let's go to Leaders. Wow. Oh, he's good. He is really good. Let's, uh, let's buy him. Let's buy him before we actually uh, not do that. And I'll be, I will be regretting that. So, you. Okay, so day of arrival is now. Let's see what happens. And how strong are these guys? Yeah, okay. Let's make sure that no ship gets in there. And he's actually pulling back. That is really nice to have. Look at that. Plus 20 in the system. Awesome. Awesome. So we just skip this system once he's back. I don't think he will continue alongside of its, uh, its area. Uh, let's see. Are you doing anything? He is not. Go away. You go here like that then. I still want to go through my borders and stuff like that. So what's this? 
the um, Zed Vash are the ancients of the secret Romulan um, Cobal and the Tarshar operatives. According to uh, sources, it was thousands upon thousands of years old. It may, uh, and it supposedly um, predated the departure of the Romulan people from Vulcan. The Romulans, that term Vat Vash, are used to refer to the dead. The only re uh, reliable keepers of secrets. Their sole purpose is to prevent the other devastation uh, wrought by synthetic destroyers called Z. Okay. Mm, containing within the administration. Uh, at Monite. At wow. At Monichen. Whatever. And dedicated themselves to eliminating synthetics. Are. Uh, so as to prevent another such event. We will be embracing this. Uh, because I think it's more important that we do. Let's embrace that and we'll just make war with all of synthetic species. And we got a new edict. So we'll look into that. Um, let's see, where are my edicts? There are edicts. So, government, government ethic, attraction, and happiness. Sharing the burden is actually quite good to have. But we're saving up on influence, do we? Because we do want to expand a tiny bit more. Uh, you are ab about to be done. Then I want you to go here and build up that outpost. And we'll just see how far we can actually go. We have that guy... There is another scientist who's not doing anything. I want you to go there, here. Go over there. And the other one is going into this direction. So there's the other colony ship. Uh, I want to start making another science ship. And the starbase itself, uh, we can already... We could go for a trade depot early on. We can actually build another starbase in here to go for trade. If we build it over there. Trade from here and here. Hopefully will be taken. So I'm thinking about building a starship and uh, a starbase in here. Don't need that right now. I didn't mean to click you. I didn't mean to click the station here. Okay, so we do need more alloys. Eventually we'll get there. Hmm. I want to get as much as possible. Annoyingly enough, I am still struggling with, uh, with lag. So yeah, that, that's, that's a bit of a shame. I was kind of hoping it wasn't the case. But then again, my computer is, well, somewhat old. It is somewhat old. So, there's the new science ship. We do have a scientist that's not doing anything. Nigel, over there. You go... He went in that direction. I want you to go here. The cyst research will do later. That's already surveyed. Go there as well. Just go over there. Uh, by that time, automatic exploration is going to be done. And I do want to make sure that they jump out... Of any problems that time any at, at the second they got it we got a lot of expansion to do guys look at that it's like i'm playing a multiplayer game it is still somewhat lagging a lot which is annoying especially at the early month so it could be the game well let's just hope the end game is going to be better than it used to be Okay, let's uh, start building up the fleet. Let's assign a leader. Ship firing rate. Combat disengagement chance, so he won't give up. I like the scout as well, because those guys, they actually see further. Being aggressive right now might be good to have so are you guys all upgraded now 25 is not something that we'll get because we just don't have the naval capacity for it but we do want to make sure that we get more ships so you how expensive was an outpost again did, did we 
yeah, it does indeed cost us alloys. So many things I've forgotten in such a long time. So, we got the shield head punch plus 5. So, we got new ships. New ship type. A short range defender. Uh, I like having strike crafts because they are the best form of defense on stations. But as long as we don't have FTL uh, inhibitors and stuff like that. Building up stations for defense is just useless. Unless you can draw them into a station then it's good. But otherwise they would just bypass it. So we go for polarizing hull. And artificial singularity core is an upgrade for our warp core. Colony development speed... Plus 25. Actually, we'll go for it since we are going to be colonizing quite a bit. Well, we've got two, two planets right now that's being colonized, so yeah. While building up our ship, our fleet power, uh, we want to make sure that we're strong enough to, you know, <laughs> once we um, detect another an alien empire, which I actually find strange that we don't know where the Vulcans are. Uh, we've traveled away, and I know it's been a long time, but why wouldn't we know where our home system is? Why, why don't we know where the Vulcans are? Like, that the Vulcans don't know where we are? Okay, I can understand. But since we traveled away from our home system, I'd say it would be only natural that we know where, where the hell that is. Okay, let's see if we can get that trait. Let's see, a hundred... Okay. Uh, regional capital, that's going to be nice. Uh, envoy assassination, that is not good. Leader cost, negative 20 again. Mm. Unlocking console. Yeah, we'll go for the merchant marines. Uh, because I like the the hull and armor regen as long as we don't have shields. Other than that, it's useless. So, Envoy Assassination. Our spies have identified several envoys that are actively working against the interest of the Romulan Star Empire. And promoting the interests of their own states. They are an upcoming diplomatic conference that... Um, there is an upcoming diplomatic conference that will invoke the envoys and ambassadors from multiple different states uh, and empires, which is weird because we haven't re um, really found any of them. This represents itself as an ex um, excellent opportunity to assassinate a foreign envoy and set back one of our Ryman's diplomatic efforts. Yeah, you know, you can't really revisiting list. See, there's nothing you can do. They're targeting us is the only option that we actually have. So we know that we'll see that event happen every now and then. And all of this is done. Are all my ships ready? They're doing... He is going to be colonizing shortly. Scientist leveled up. That's quite good. Yeah, we'll save up. And once we actually start hitting that cap, we'll be buying... You know, more alloys and stuff like that. So, domestic suppression, low intensity, because we didn't integrate anyone yet. Uh, well, then again, we don't have any other um, planets anyways. So, we want to get towards Nimbus once he is done. Uh, actually, we'll go mining station. Stop. You're currently building that, right? Yeah. Okay, then I want you to go build Star Empire there. Star Empire, build a station over there. While we should be able to build... Oh man, 250? You gotta be joking, man. That's so expensive. Oh, there we go. We got unemployment. That's great. That is great. Uh, amenities. Well, amenities is very important. Uh, but upgrading the regional capital will be... Enough, but that is not going to happen anytime soon. We could be upgrade that over there, actually. Get unemployment. I'm actually going to do that. 
Yeah, I don't have the number of pops yet, and... That is fine. Can't do anything with that. So, are we going to be selecting amenities? Because once we get to the next pop, we can actually build amenities as well. And... Amity, not having amenities is bad. Definitely bad. So, maybe now amenities... We could also go for admin center, getting more trade, getting more unity, and just a tiny bit of amenities. We don't have crime, so that's not going to work. The trading center itself is not too important right now. Armies don't generate that, so yeah, I'm actually considering going... Do we need these as well? Limit to a planet is one. We need this on every planet, it seems. Darn it. Get rid of that. We can only build three on every planet. So let's go with an admin center. And the next up is going to be research. As for you, we'll do the same thing because we want to have as much trade as possible. He is there. You're going to be building into that. That's fine. Uh, another system has been explored. Let us uh, increase the uh, the volume of that because I felt this was quite low. This planet has been claimed for the glory of the empire. Okay, nice. So one of the planets is now going to be done. Um, we are going to be building a colony ship in advance. Uh, to send over to Nimbus. Because he's going there anyways, right? So, we got the Merchant Marines. Slave livering, uh, liver, uh, Living Standards. Well, we don't have them yet. Uh, let's go for Import and Advanced Water Purification. We will never build these, though. At least I don't think so. And we'll go for the... We'll go for the main engineering console. Uh, I think I do want to start buying minerals. Sell 500. Something like that. Now, we can actually build this station. So, let's upgrade you. Um, we we'll have to keep some alloys around. Okay, where are you? Where's my ship going? Okay. Yeah, you got a lot of stuff to do. Uh, once that's claimed, we'll go for the, uh, the science. Man, some of these systems are absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So here we go. We go for anomaly discovery chance. And then we go. I actually know the special output the Think Fang technology is actually quite good to have. I don't think it's an edict. No, it isn't. Which is fine. We got enough. So maybe, maybe, just maybe, research pleat is something that we want to activate. Since we good, we don't build as many systems right now. Sharing the burners, slave happiness. I don't have slaves, guys. At least. See, slave resident. These guys are residents. So, yeah. There's no need to do that. Great discoveries await us. Yes. I do agree. Great discoveries await us. Let's wait until those are done. Colony development speed, so that might just help these. I think it though it's an is it an edict? No, not yet. Hmm, alloy production. I don't think that is too important right now. Let's go for the optical computer. Uh, 
And we can actually upgrade our fleet. Why is that? Let's take a look. What changed? Oh, here we go. The polarizing hull. And now we can actually save this. What a joy. Can I now get rid of this space? No, we can't. Oh, well, whatever. Anything over here? Hmm. 